Hello everyone, Space Junk here and welcome to yet another lore and history video and in this video I'll be talking about something that I've mentioned before in my other video and that is Witch Base and what is Witch Base and where does it come from? So basically, which base is the dimension that you go into briefly when you activate your FSD drive? On my recent video of, uh, of uh, FSD drives, uh, I mentioned it briefly. And I also mentioned that it's a dangerous space where vehicles and other objects can travel faster than the speed of light without actually going faster than the speed of light. And I know that sounds ridiculous, and it quite frankly is, but it has everything to do with the Alcubier drive. Like I mentioned in my other video as well, the Alcubier drive makes it possible to transport something faster than the speed of light without actually breaking any laws of physics. And what is it basically? Um, it does this by contracting the space in front of the vehicle or the object and expanding the space behind it so that it kind of uh, lets the space move it around instead of moving around by itself. It's a really weird concept, it obviously uh, has not been proven in real life. But uh, this is how frameshift drives work in Elite Dangerous. Now, in order to activate the Alcubier drive in Elite Dangerous, you use the frameshift. And you go into Hypercruise, which basically is a high-speed cruising system. Uh, where you just go from, you know, from the sun to, um, or from a star to, you know, a planet for example. You use hypercruise, and there you go much, much, much faster than the speed of light, which is basically the Alcubierre system um, in form. But if you want to warp to another system, you enter Witch Base briefly. So Witch Base is basically a different, um, it's basically a different dimension where you, where it's possible to move even faster than in the dimension that we're in right now. You need a static point that has a huge mass in order to effectively warp towards it, like a sun or something else that's that big, or a star. I continuously say sun, but I mean a star. That um, that's why you always end at a star as well when you exit from your frameshift drive. You always end at the star because that's the biggest point in that region. However, which base is much more scary than it sounds. There have been stories from Elite 1 and Elite 2 in which the alien species the Thorgoids were actually, were actually able to pull you out of Witch Base, destroying your ship and destroying everyone who's on the ship. They say that the Thorgoids still lurk deep within Witch Base, but I'm kind of skeptical about that because I know that the Thorgoids have been defeated and that the Thorgoids are probably dead. However, we don't know. And there have been a lot of hints that they might not be dead at all. And because of recent discoveries, the travel time within which space has been decreased very much, making it not really a threat to begin with. This made me thinking though, remember the huge capital ships from both factions. Um, they still use the old, uh, the old um, frameshift drive and also the Ocelot stations do the same. The thing is though, is they still use the old witch base, or we also use witch base but they are uh, in there much longer because like I said in my previous video uh, of uh, FSD the old FSD took much longer to travel through witch base because they didn't have the recent discoveries or recent technologies that the newer ships have and they still have the old frameshift because their mass is too much for the new frameshift drive and that's also why that whenever they leave witch base they terror this huge rip through uh, space which looks awesome so don't change that but you know it's not really it's not really the most tactical thing to begin with and also um, they should really think about making a frameship drive that can really take them as fast as other ships can but that's not the point the point is that the Thargoids could really, in, th in theory, the Thargoids could just yank out one of their one of the capital ships, and maybe that is bound to happen in the future. Who knows? So yeah, much more on which base I couldn't really find. It's basically 
a very interesting place that doesn't really have a lot of stories. It's basically um, basically a lot of speculation, but also from um, the lore of Elite Dangerous. A lot of a lot of people uh, outside of you know in the real world don't know a lot about this witch base, but also in the game itself, it's 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 a very mysterious region. Uh, the only thing that they do know is that it's that you can uh, go really quick there and you, they can use it for uh, for a warp if you will so yeah I don't really have much more on this subject unfortunately I wish I had uh, if you guys have more information please do tell me in the comments I would love to know um, and uh, yeah I'll see you guys later uh, please like and subscribe if you and I'll see you guys in another video cheers